So hello guys, I've been hinting about uh, something that we're working on and um, it's it has to do with um, this electricity. You've um, not really um, experienced 24 hours electricity like throughout your lifetime. You've been used to power outage here and there and sometimes power outage for a very long time. Do you desire 24 hours electricity and um, if yes is that answer then you should stick with us because we're about to uh, start dishing out some information that will help you so i would say right there and there if you are watching on youtube subscribe if you're watching on facebook like the page because this will really save you some money and headache so who are we my name is tobo duaye i'm a filmmaker and uh, an enthusiast in the renewable energy and here i'm um, in you know known as solar ninja i'm a solar engineer and a solar and inverter engineer and when it comes to designing and installation installing solar inverter for both residential and commercial purpose i'm there all right so Chinedu, let's start with this is 24 hours electricity is it um is it a possibility in nigeria yes it is um, maybe i'll come into a yes and no it's possible it's not possible all right so first start with the bad one start with the no why okay. is it impossible okay why i said no it's not possible is this if you should depend on the government the discourse and the generating company of nigeria to provide this 24 hours electricity for seven good days in a week and then all through the year, then is a no for you. Why? Because as we Nigeria, as we know, we are about 200 million persons in Nigeria. And the rule of thumb for electricity generation in the world is 1,000 megawatts to 1 million persons. So here in Nigeria now, we are 200 million persons. So what, what we need to really generate electricity 24 7 for all nigeria is 200,000 megawatts of electricity wait today 200,000 megawatts of electricity so what do are we generating now presently as of october 2020 the minister of power said what we are able to generate that we are able to move from eight eight thousand to thirteen thousand that is about 6.5% of the 200,000 megawatts that we need. I said, we are just, we celebrated moving from 8,000 megawatts to 13,000 megawatts. So we are still far, far behind. We still have about 94.5% way to go. Uh, we are far, we are far. 8,000 that we're celebrating, we're not even utilizing that 8,000. I believe that 8,000 of 200, that's about 4%. Yeah. So le let's leave Let's leave the discourse. Of course, we are, We know, I grew up shouting, up, up there power power. when there were, when letters. <laughs> that's true. That's so true. I know I'm not depending on that, but wait. So you said yes and no. So let's talk about the yes. How can it be possible to have 24 7 electricity i'm not talking about 24 hours in one day and the next day nothing yeah. 24 7 like consistently, consistently. How, how is that possible okay. is it possible you it's, said yes it's possible so how it's only possible when you as a home owner or a business owner you decide to go for alternative that's alternative electricity generation generating means all right so what are the alternatives okay. that we have uh, me and you, we know about the generating set. That ah, is generator. That, that is that is that. one alternative, and that is the m most commonly used source of energy aside I from the national grid, which we call NEPA in Nigeria generating set. And then we have the inverter system, inverter backup system, where you have inverter and battery. Then we have wind energy, wind turbine, and then we talk about solar system, where you use the solar now to. To do the work so from from what i gather like i said i'm an enthusiast and i've been into this from researching and everything from what i gather wind is not something that we really use here maybe because of our weather we don't really have strong wind. wind is not just popular so let's leave it aside generator we all know 
you buy generator, you service, you buy fuel, and fuel is like every ah, time. Ah, the hike you know? is the, the price now is not is not something think about funny. The, think about those times when um, there's um, fuel scarcity. I remember mm. this last, you know, recently we've been having in yes, yes. like fuel scarcity is here and there, and the first thing my in fact if I don't have fuel in the car it's still better for me but if i don't have fuel in the generator that one gives me more headache so sure whenever there's fuel scarcity you know in those times when there was first scarcity, i remember how we also go to petrol station with 50 with, with jerry cans also, also, you know they will tell you no you must for every jerry car you must drop money and you will see aside mind. as aside the fuel issue in generating set are you thought of the noise that comes with it my generator the noise then, then okay you own then. generator can you even sleep with it mm -hmm. you are thinking. scared of, you are scared of maybe someone coming at night to steal the gen outside yeah so yeah. so let's now look at so or even now, the pollution aspect of it we've talked about generator we've talked about wind uh, amongst the three alternatives so we are left with one we are solar. left with two Inverter, power uh, inverter, yeah, and inverter and, solar and then inverter. solar. So let's talk about inverter. It looks okay. like inverter is our best option. Right? In, in bat, inverter backup, we're talking about having an inverter and then a battery. Now, when you have the grid power, that is NEPA, you charge up your battery using the grid. Then when the when you now have um, power outage, you now depend on what has been stored in the battery mm -hmm. for you to generate this electricity for you to use. So now you are dependent on this battery and on NEPA. So if there is no national grid, there is, there is no NEPA, what happened? You lack that 24 hours life. So still, we say there is still, it's not still that viable because so, so once it, there is no NEPA. So you're saying like we are still not independent of NEPA, NEPA with, because with we are still dependent if NEPA decides to make, mess you up. Or if your transformer becomes faulty. Or there's no fuel to power the to generator. Power the, your so, gener you can, because you can see so, the generator, so there's no fuel. So we are still losing. So now we're left with solar inverter. So does can you rely on solar for 24 hours electricity? Okay, yes, we can. Okay. That's the best option here now. Solar energy. Hmm. Solar energy. Yes. I've been hearing solar energy for years. Is it not like crazily expensive? It's not. Are you sure? Okay, it's not. Okay, let's talk about it in one minute and, you know, all right. Okay. When you talk about solar energy, we're talking about using the the sun. And you and I know in Nigeria, we have the sun in abundance. And there's one thing we need to know. is that the sun that is being generated a day is enough to power the whole world for one year. A day to power the, sun the whole world gener one. If you can capture the sun that is being generated in a day, you can use it to to power the whole world for one year. Wow. Now, wow. if you can capture the sun, let's you as an individual and, and you capture a particular free. percentage and it's free. <laughs> it's free. You're so, not paying for it. So that's so, why it's renewable. So that means the sun can actually power your house. Yes. For 24 hours. Yes, it's, so, but, it's possible. But most of the time, but why are people not using it? I think we need to stop here because we've been talking now for about 10 minutes why people are not using it. So we're going to do another video and we're going to be doing more videos where you are going to learn how to even... This is like a DIY where you will learn how to be able to install inverters yourself yes. and you'll be able to size your house, know what you require and know how to get it at a very affordable price yes. because we all th we thought that inverter is very expensive but it's not actually very as that expensive as we thought about it at a very affordable price so guys stick with us you are really really going to learn a lot a lot this. a lot all right so guys we're going to watch out for the next video is coming soon thank you bye